Rock here. Welcome to the channel. Jen is with me. Bago chum. I think we found some striper. So obviously we're back on the towel. Try to chum them up. See if we can get a fish in the boat. Because Jen wants to catch a striper. Right. So do I. All right. She's got her bait stolen, so there's something down there. How deep were you? Can it hit there? No. It didn't. Oh, fish on. I got a fish on. All right. Oh. Oh, I see them. They're swarming down there. Oh, no. Fish on. Fish on. Double hookup. Oh. Oh, man. Oh. Oh. Oh, look, look, folks. Oh, you got a nice one. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Check that out. That's a big one. Nice. Oh, I saw that. Wow. Oh, double hookups. <laughs> We're going to get. Tangled. Oh. Alright, take him. Oh. oh, we're tangled up. Oh. Who's Where's your going? Real. Oh. You should reel. Jim's off. I still got a striper on that one. It's not windy. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Speaking of wind, the wind's supposed to howl. Oh, I still got a fish on. What am I doing? <laughs> fish on, Jim? Yeah. Oh, no, look at that. Oh, what? <laughs> nice nice good job. Big so, we're using uh, half ounce saltwater jig heads to get down quick. And just put some chovy on it. You gonna hand me a piece while you're in there? Thank you, thank you. And that seems to be doing the job. And if I neglected to say, it is, what are we at? Just at the beginning of May, like the first few days. So I was out here two weeks ago and I really put a hurting on them. And Jen saw the videos and was like, you gotta get me out here. So here we are. And we've uh, well, we found some more striper, that's for sure. So. Oh, that fish on. Fish on. This is crazy. Good lord. Oh. Nice. oh, yeah, that's a nice size right there. I like these little ones, they're really good eating, so I'm gonna keep this one. It's not pretty, but it, uh, it does the job. Right, Jim? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Again, we're in a huge school. You can see just another massive school here. Oh, goodness. Oh, gotcha. Anyone? Hey, oh, <laughs> you got one, Jim? I got one. It's a little bigger. Oh, oh yeah. Nice, Jim. Thank nice you. catch. Thank you. Thank you. 
Yeah. It's on. It's on. It swarms up and down there. I can see them. Oh no. Oh. Yeah, having a rag helps. They're spiny sons of guns can be. But uh, yeah, these little ones are good eating, man. They're healthy. Ooh, boy. It's warmed up a little bit too since the last trip, two weeks ago. Early May now. I think the high today's mid 80s. And we're supposed to get gusting wind 25 miles per hour tonight. And here we are. They getting you over there, Jen? Nice one there. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Woo, baby, that's a nice one. They're following it. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh my goodness. It's happening again, folks. It's happening. Man, it's a nice one there. So it's gonna happen. <laughs> That's the goal, isn't it? Oh yeah. It's as big as me. <laughs> it's a dinosaur, eh? <laughs> it's pretty big. <laughs> nice catch, Jen. Heck yeah. You got another fish, Jen? Really? <laughs> Let me get down there and see if we can get a double hookup. <laughs> I'm gonna wait till you get them up. Oh, that's a nice one. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Look at that one. Woo! Nice fish. Wow, Jen, that's a nice one. Oh my goodness. Yeah, look at that. What? <laughs> well done. All right, I want to catch one like that one, Jen. That was pretty nice. Oh, gotcha. Woo! Oh. It's happening. It is happening. Oh, no. All right. Very nice. Very nice. Fish on, Jen. Good night. And again, yeah? yeah. Is that the one? Mm, I don't think it's as nice as that other one. Oh, that one. That was, take it still. Nice. Oh, nice. oh man. <laughs> oh, nice. That one's kind of sizable. Oh, yeah. Wow. Nice, Jen. Ooh, mercy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That'll work, huh? That's right. <laughs> yeah. That one looks nice. You got some shoulders on it? Yeah, you do. <laughs> All right. I'm getting just robbed. I can, they're swarming like 10 feet down. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh, got you on that one. <laughs> yes. Oh. oh it's a little guy. Yeah. It's a little fella. <laughs> I'll take it. These little guys are swarming down there. All right. It's we're just in a massive school. I mean, we could just sit here and probably pull 100 fish, huh? 
It's ridiculous. Yeah. So we're actually going to move on and try a different spot. So here we go. Here we go. That's pretty fun, huh, Jen? Yeah. Oh, I got some nice striper thumb going all yeah, of a sudden. Me too. Yeah, buddy. All right, we're actually um, we're going to head out to the Rock Creek area, and we got to figure out some place to duck out of the wind. Like I mentioned earlier, it's supposed to gust 25 miles per hour. It's dead calm right now. Maybe it won't. I mean, who knows, right? But we want to get situated and fish for some smallies and all that other kind of stuff. Find a decent place to camp. Yeah? Yeah. All right, well, gassing up and moving on. Two feet of water, Jen. Wow. Yeah. It's skinny. <laughs> Like you made it. Okay, <laughs> I got right. over it. Cool. And this <laughs> drops a little bit more. Yeah. Fish on? What do you got, Jen? Yeah, That's what you got, fish, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's a little. Yeah. Oh, is it smally action? Indeed it is. <laughs> Look at that little fella. Oh, oh. that's your first smally of 2021, eh, Jen? <laughs> oh, so little. He's like as big as my hand. What did you get it on? A little Ned rig? A little Ned rig, about the same size as the fish. Oh, let's see. Jen's using a Ned Ray. We're just kind of casting into the rocks piles here. And I'm doing the old white grub action. All right, we're gonna do a little trolling along the cliff walls here. We're gonna stick to the rattle traps. We're both gonna use the rattle traps. It seemed to work. And we're gonna keep a lookout for a place to camp. So maybe we can pick up a smally this way. They will hit on rattle traps. All right, we're heading to the back of Rock Creek just to see if there's any striper hanging out in the back of the canyon. We found a pretty good place that I think we can camp. The wind really picks up, it's kind of protected. And it looks good, so if we don't find any striper, we'll pull back up. It's already 5, 5 p.m., so if we don't find any striper, we'll, we'll head back and uh, get ourselves hunkered down for the evening. Okay. Getting those rattle traps in the water. We're going to watch the graph starting at 50 feet of water. I'm going to work our way back. See what we see. What do you think, Jen? Think they're back here? Yeah, probably. This one. Yeah? Yep, this one. Oh, it's a nice one. Oh. Man. 40 feet of water. I didn't even see anything on the ground. <laughs> I just took a drink of soda. I'm choked. <laughs> Do you need the net? Uh, yeah, probably. There's a rattle trap. I'm not getting down there. It's a little striper. Yep. Got him. Yeah, you did. <laughs> nice striper in the back of Rock Creek. Fish on. Oh, it's a nice one.
That's a nice one there, folks. <laughs> oh man, that's a big healthy one. I'm not gonna keep that. Shoot again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See ya. Right? <laughs> one you just had on. Jen just had one hit, busted the leader. Lost a rattle trap. There's some nice ones back here, that's for sure. Nice healthy ones back here. Yeah. <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> How's it going up there? Good. All done. Yeah, the gust definitely started. But it's calmed down now a little bit. There looks like there's some weather moving through. We may get some rain. We may not, you never know. But we're tucked into this spot here. We've got a tent kind of in this slope and we've got a guide out. I mean, it's just about as good as it's gonna get, huh, Jen? Yeah. Uh, there's deep mud right here, so we gotta be careful, but um, pretty protected. I feel good, secure about the boat if the wind does continue to gust tonight, but um, I don't know, I feel pretty secure back here. For the most part yeah we're good yeah so now we're just unloading and getting everything set up i got to uh i gotta clean some striper yeah mm, looking forward to that <laughs> so i'm gonna clean some striper and then we're gonna cook the striper and that's what we're gonna have for dinner so that'll be pretty cool we're gonna do a lemon pepper striper fresh lemon pepper striper it's gonna be delicious i think so and some pasta salad stick around and folks if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe it really helps us out right jen That's right. yeah all right we're going to continue doing what we're doing <laughs> all right kept striper in there three or four that'll do So I got a piece of Lexan screwed onto this thing so I can fillet up right here. This is, these little guys are actually really good. Hmm. Alright, well, the fish are cleaned and we keep hearing thunder. <laughs> it's not gonna rain. Nice clean <clears throat> fillets, right? Oh yeah. Nice clean fillets. And yeah, we're gonna get 
get some lemon on those. Can't be shy with the lemon, can you, babe? Oh, no. Lots of lemon in there. Just like that. And then, lemon pepper. Yeah. Be generous with this, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's nice. And there we go, and that's it. That's going to be it. I'll wrap that. Hobo meal. And that's done. Toss it in the fire for a few minutes. Voila. Dinner served. a little early because we're starving. <clears throat> Looks like we got fuego. Sweet. Yeah. And it's as simple as this. Check that out. What? What? All right, Jen. <clears throat> you tell me how it is. Mm, that's good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's cooked through. Yes, it is. That'll work just fine. And a nice pasta salad to complement the fresh striper. That's right. There it is. Beer 30. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, we started out uh, so I we went to a canyon and we didn't put any fish on it. Then we came
came out in the main channel and uh, man, we got right on top of a massive school and really, it was on, man. Yeah, we came back to the back of Rock Creek, did some trolling, found some nice striper back here, so. And the wind came up, it took a while to get the camp set up, but um, <clears throat> we're good. And it's still looking like weather, so hopefully we don't get rained on, but um, I think we're done for the night. We may end up catfishing. I don't know. We'll see. We'll go either way, huh? Yeah, <clears throat> we're both pretty tired, actually, but we'll see. We'll see what happens once it gets dark. But yeah, all in all, it's a pretty darn good day. Yeah, really good. For sure. So, folks, cheers. All right, well, we had to put the fly on the tent because it has begun to rain. <laughs> yes, that's what I wanted to happen. <laughs> the weather's calmed down, wind has calmed down. I think that's it. And there's, you see right there, there's a uh, mice on board. Yep. What can you do? What can you do? Anyway, I think we're going to wrap it and get some sleep. All right. That's a wrap. I'd say it was an epic day. We caught a lot of fish. What do you say, Jen? Oh, yeah. Jen's out. I'm soon to be out. And it's not much else to say. We found the striper, I wanted to say. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll see you tomorrow. Do you rock out? No, no. Buenas noches. Buenos dias, Jen. Buenos dias, Dave. Yep, we are packed up and out of there. It's time for some breakfast. Yeah, a little bit of yogurt, get the day started. Well, it rained on us how many times last night? Three times, I think. Three or maybe four times, sounded like to me. But uh, we stayed dry and uh, it's a calm, beautiful morning. So. Our plan is to, we're not going to actually stay out here very late today. We're going to try and fish our way back. We've got to be somewhere, so hopefully we can come across another school or a small year or two, but uh, we're kind of limited on time. So we're going to get to it after breakfast. Let's roll.
So with the uh, low water levels, um, it's exposing some interesting rock formations. <clears throat> That's for sure. All right, let's ride. Woo! <laughs> well, <clears throat> we just had a pucker moment. Our gas line was messed up and couldn't get gas into the motor, but I must have jarred it <clears throat> yesterday getting in and out of the boat or something, but all the connections are back in order and uh, uh, seems to be okay. But uh, did you feel your heart sink there for a second? Yeah, I thought you seen that mouse get on the boat last night. I was yeah, like, there's oh, mice no. in the boat, so I was like, oh, that <laughs> damn thing chewed lines. <laughs> so I think we're okay. We're, we're rolling. <laughs> Okay, we think we might have found some striper that is, so we're gonna sit over here and chum up a little bit. Maybe we can uh, get a party started or something. So, we've got these, I've diced up really small bits of anchovy. We've got separate bags. If we see something, we take one of these bags, dump it in the water, it gets all the chum out there. It's not big chunks, so they start, you know, going a little nutty. So now we're gonna drop down and See if something happens. What do you think, Jen? Oh, it'll happen. And I actually got pieces of other striper too in our bag, so they eat each other. <laughs> All right, Chovy Jen has returned. <laughs> what? Fish on? And you caught on a piece of striper, huh? <laughs> sure did. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah, they're down there. Nice, Jen. Check me out. Nice. <laughs> so it's turning out pretty slow over here, even though we chummed it up. But Jim, Jen did get a striper on a piece of cut striper. This is like some of the gristle that was from leftover last night after I cleaned those fish. <laughs> they all readily hit it. But it's kind of slow over here, so we're going to give it another shot just for a few minutes and then uh, we're going to move on down the road or lake, so to say. Oh, Jen saw a smallie as so we came around the corner. <laughs> I tossed a Ned ring over there. Oh, yeah. There he is. There we go. Yeah, it's a smallie, all right. <laughs> all right, onward. Next destination. All these cliff walls here, close to antelope. See if anything's happening. Not getting much action along the walls near antelope. It doesn't mean they're not here. It just means they're not here when we're here. <laughs> so we're just kind of moving down the walls as we get closer to antelope and um, dropping, giving it a few minutes. Nothing. They will pull up and move on down. Oh yeah. <laughs> How deep were you? Uh, 30 feet. 30? Nice. Need the net? No. Wow, oh, they're hitting on striper and not anchovy, huh? That's funny, huh? That is. <laughs> That's really funny. It's a nice healthy striper. Another one, Jim? <laughs> Can you do this one towards me or are you very big? Oh, he's pretty small. Nice <laughs> job. How deep were you? Uh, about 30 feet. Oh, Maybe save the bait too. Yeah. Nice and done. Yeah, man. That mouse got a good meal last night. Check that out. All right, we're moving on. Okay, that's almost a wrap for the day. <clears throat> we're going to stop off at buoy three here. See if anything's happening. So I'm using anchovy. Jen's using the striper. And 
this morning, what, Jen, all the striper we've caught has been off the cut striper. Yes. Not off the anchovy. So, uh, striper works well for catching striper. <laughs> well, we just came back from the dam and we fished the point over there. We tried buoy three. We've been hitting and running. Not spending a lot of time at these places just because we're on a schedule, so to speak. And we didn't find any fish in these areas. Our last, uh, well, you got a hit at the point, didn't you? I did. Uh, our last uh, spot was antelope where uh, Jen pulled some in. That seemed to be the best area, but we didn't stay there for very long either. So there you have it. Striper fishing still, still on. I mean, we found them. We found them almost everywhere we went. Early May. What more can we say? It was a great trip. Yeah. So as always, folks, thank you very much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you to the patrons. If you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. It really helps the channel. Any comments, Jen? No, great trip. Can't wait to come back. Till next time. All right, folks. Tight lines. We'll see you then. D-Rock out. Jen out. Adios.